So when she was in rehab, we had discussions with the uh, administration there, and they said, you basically have two choices. She either goes to an assisted living facility or she has AIDS 24-7 in the house because she can't be left alone. So after doing our research, we went to a few places. We picked the greens. Um, number one, we felt very comfortable here, my brother, sister-in-law, and I. So we had a good feeling. And second of all, it's perfect location. I'm in Norwalk, my brother's in Richfield, so it's just about equidistant, about 15 minutes for each of us. And I must say she adjusted really well. I thank the staff for making her comfortable, whether it was the aides, the nurses, the recreation staff, the administration, and uh, she does feel very happy here. And I like the idea that she is certainly watched 24-7 and she also has lots to do because, as I said, she was very independent. She's very with it, and I feel it's even better than when she was living at home because she has much more to do here. She goes to a lot of the activities. She makes friends with the people here. So the socialization has been great. When all is said and done, I think she's very happy. I think she's happy because she feels safe and she feels that she's not relying on my brother, sister-in-law, and I as much as she had to. So, and a relief that she doesn't have to worry about the house. Oh, I'm very happy because now I have more time to spend with her as a daughter as opposed to um, maintaining her living situation, if you will.